Hey guys, how's it going? Um, real quick today, um, <clears throat> what's going on is we have one more opportunity for diplomacy. And um, I want to show you something, an old video, a very short video <clears throat> that many of you are probably familiar with that came out a very long time ago. Um, you'll see what I mean in just a minute. But before that, we're going to have Russia's top diplomat, Sergei Lavrov, is set to go head-to-head -head with the U.S. Secretary of State, Anthony Blinken, in Switzerland on Friday. Moscow is confirmed amid strained relations with Washington. Speaking during a briefing on Thursday, the spokeswoman for Russia's foreign ministry, Maria Zarkova, disclosed that the two envoys will negotiate in Geneva on January 21st. According to her, the diplomats will discuss the Kremlin's proposals, which are aimed at citing security guarantees, limiting the expansion of NATO towards Russia's borders, and trying to determine possible further steps for negotiations on assurances aimed at enhancing safety on the European continent. Last week, Russian diplomats held crunch talks with NATO representatives on security issues following on from prior discussions between officials from Washington and Moscow. Anyway, <clears throat> I don't know. The rest is pretty much self-explanatory, and obviously this is not the most trustworthy news source by any means. Um, what I think about this, I don't know. Um, someone said a few days ago that they don't want to partake or give in to their black magic sorcery, which this is exactly what it appears to be. Um, but I think it is important to be aware of this sorcery because that's what this is all looking like. Um, let's hope something positive will come out of it. Um, I do think there is a chance that, like I, I've always suspected, that some sort of deal, peace deal, is going to be reached that will be breached immediately afterwards. I mean, what are they going to do at this point? Uh, Russia has sent out like 80 percent of its navy and so is the u.s um the the type of movement and preparations we're seeing are not it, it goes far beyond just russia and ukraine um and china is also mobilizing now so it, it just all implies some very premeditated type stuff okay like this sort of dog and pony nonsense over here i don't buy these diplomatic meetings are just for show and i'm not saying like that the people meeting they may have good intentions i mean i i don't know this guy a lot of people don't like him i don't know i don't think he has good intentions but some of these diplomats might genuinely have good intentions but there's something bigger at play here okay so, anyway, we are in Aquarius. We're entering Aquarius today. And this is not this is the regular zodiac, not the sidereal zodiac. Um, so, why is that important? Or why am I even bringing it up? Well, you guys remember what Aquarius looks like. Aquarius sign. Very common zodiac symbol that i'm sure you've seen half a billion times now who remembers this old video be ready new york water and the original title so this is a re-upload okay the original title was two three one one three four four two one and what the hell those numbers mean i don't know um they do add up if you individually add them adds up to 26 i believe um but yeah let's refresh our memories i think this came out in 2013 originally i think there's even any sound here designated locations right looking through historical events 
he's uh looking through time, right? I don't know, this is Adam Weissoft. That's kind of why that would even be in there. I don't even remember what this commercial was for originally. Okay, but you guys probably know. Runaway and then New York Sector Water backwards, right? Really bizarre video. Well, my point, what's my point? Okay, my point is this. <laughs> There's Aquarius. There's the Chinese New Year, or a yin-yang, right? And there's Aquarius. Uh, the, the globe could possibly represent New World, right? Um, the clock is most confusing to me. Whereas in Nipad Go 2, you see midnight, but here you see one. Why that is, I have no idea. This, a plug outlet... What is that supposed to mean? Lights out? I don't know. I just thought it was interesting that Aquarius is in here. Um, especially since we're now in Aquarius. And we're having set events taking place and are on the verge of potential catastrophe. Which may or may not play out. <clears throat> depending on intervention in certain circumstances. But I had to take note of this because I felt it was not noteworthy. Have a good day.